After the Civil War, black people started making communities where they could accumulate wealth. Organizations like the KKK and white supremacists decided that didn't get to exist. Places like Black Wall Street, Rosewood, and multiple others were burned to the ground and everyone was killed. Anyone that survived, all of their information was burned inside their houses. When black people went to the banks to retrieve their money to rebuild everything, the banks said, no, all of their bank cards have been burned. They couldn't get their money back. All of those banks still exist and still have all their money, and it's all accumulated wealth. White people from that particular time in that area were able to get their money back. This is why reparations are necessary to atone for our actions. We literally created poverty on purpose for multiple people. After the Civil War, black people started making communities where they could accumulate wealth. Organizations like the KKK and white supremacists decided that didn't get to exist. Places like Black Wall Street, Rosewood, and multiple others were burned to the ground and everyone was killed. Anyone that survived, all of their information was burned inside their houses. When black people went to the banks to retrieve their money to rebuild everything, the banks said, no, all of their bank cards have been burned. They couldn't get their money back. All of those banks still exist and still have all their money, and it's all accumulated wealth. White people from that particular time in that area were able to get their money back. This is why reparations are necessary to atone for our actions. We literally created poverty on purpose for multiple people. After the Civil War, black people started making